Alrighty, so let's see in how this is. Yep, it's a, it's actually a pretty decent magnet inside. It's actually a pretty decent magnet. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna test out the DeWalt two-piece angle detachment. All right, so the, the reason why I wanted to get this because this actually has a handle on it. You'd be able to control driving in some screws a lot better than the older model, which I don't believe the older model had a handle. So let's unbox this, test this out. We will be doing this on the DeWalt 887 with a four amp hour uh, 2100 cell battery. So, so yeah. All right, so the, the model for this is WAMRA. Uh, it's a quarter inch hex. Uh, it, it is magnetized, 90, 90 degree angle to be used on impact drivers only. I wonder why that is. So we will be doing some, uh, some long screws with this. I love it that they put on that box to be used on impact driver only. This is the display. I'll show you guys actually what it physically, how it physically is. So let's open this up. That's interesting. So this is actually metal right here. It's not all metal, but the head is actually metal. So I'm assuming that's a, how you unlock it or it locks into place with a certain, put it in like that, locks into place. I'm wondering if this locks into place in other situ. Nope, it only goes on one way. The handle better have some, uh, handle better have a little bit The handle better have a little bit of a, uh, you know, strength to it. All right, it goes on like that. And then I. So I'm guessing you can't use them both at the same time because it won't lock into place now. So the handle is for this one only. And then you can control it like that, which, yeah, we're going to have to test that out. That doesn't seem like it's pretty, uh, like it's pretty durable. Yeah, we're gonna test them both out like that. At first, I want to test out this handle, so let's uh, get to it. Let's uh, test this out. All right, let's see on how well it does driving in an eight-inch timber lock. I feel like I'm gonna have to do this on an angle, like this. Let's see if this handle really does help. We're gonna do it without. Uh, I'm gonna do it holding it like this first. Then we'll try the handle. Time. All right, now let's try that handle. Let's see if that handle survives. Ready? Go. Yeah, see, like, you can't put too much pressure on with that handle because it's plastic. You know, it, it's not, there's not a lot of material right here to like pr put a little pressure down. Yeah, see like the, like you can't like you can't put too much pressure down. But that this channel is going to test this out. I am going to put the necessary pressure down to see to see if I could even do it. Time. Yeah, that's not going to last too long if you need to do that. It's not. All right, so let's take this out with holding the head. Ready, go. Oh, I'm sorry, wrong way. Ready, okay, let's take it out a little bit. All right, ready, go. Got it. Yeah, that that's that's an inconvenience. That's an inconvenience. All right, now let's see if I can do it with the handle. Right, the main like this is like the main feature that I was excited about, but it turned it turns out that the handle is plastic. The the housing for the handle is plastic. You know, I thought it needs to be metal for this to actually serve a purpose. 
Now, because even doing like three inch screws, you still need to put a lot of pressure down to get it to be able to bite into the, the head or you're gonna strip the screw in. So like you need to be able to put a lot of pressure on this like every time. This isn't a specialty tool. People do use these all the time. Let's take it out. There we go. But yeah. All right, now let's, uh, I normally don't use three inch screws on this channel because it's too easy, but we are gonna do a three inch, a couple of three inch screws. Sorry, we'll do, we'll do uh, two four inch screws. But like these, you're gonna have to put a lot of pressure on this to do a four inch screw without stripping it. All right, so ready? We'll do with the head first. Ready, go. You know, and we're, we're gonna switch this to speed two. Speed three might be a bit too much for it. Ready? Go. Time. Uh, let's do the this one next with the handle. Hey, even getting the screw on it, that sucks. Like this is what it's, this is exactly what it's designed for. You know, like to, you're going to have to work the tool like this. All right, so ready, go. Time. Let's take it out. I'm holding the head on this one. Ready, go. And this time hold the handle. Ready, go. Yeah, see, that's not good. Like you're like it's skipping too much for that. I, I'm not. I, I don't like that. It's not. It's not strong enough. Like it's not. It doesn't have enough material on it to actually do it. To do what you need to do with it. it, it seems fragile. Like you would break that like nothing. But let's try the extension. Let's see on how well this goes. Now I am disappointed. Uh, I I was hoping you'd be able to do both, like that. But that's not how it works. Yeah, but you see, even the even the the screws, the the threads inside, the threads inside are plastic. Like th that's not going to last long at all. That ha this handle is going to be useless after a while because there'll, there'll be no threads right there. You'd be forced to use the other side, and then that's going to go too. So this this is sort of useless. It really is. Right, let's try the extender. Let's try the extension. Let's give that a shot. Yeah, th these two pieces aren't worth that purchase. It's not. Those are pretty much garbage. All right, let's try this. As you see, you have a good handle to grip on. That that has some that has some surface for you to grab. All right, this is on speed two. Much better. That is much better. Yeah, that handle thing is garbage. Let's do another one on speed three. Let's see if it's easily, uh, let's see if you can control it easily. All right, ready? Go. Time. If you're in a if you're in a sticky situation and you can't get that impact uh, full impact driver in, and that works, th that'll work. That'll work. If it could do an eight inch timber lock like that, it'll do smaller screws. Uh, let's take it out. Ready? Go. Oh, that 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 head is this head is getting hot. That head is getting hot. 
We'll do a temperature reading after this. All right, ready? Go. Not bad. Yeah, see, like that handle sucks. Like that's much better. That's much better. Let's do a temperature reading on that head. 91, 82, 99, 83, 105, 105 degrees right here. Yeah, so that, that head's getting hot. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, but uh, when it comes to this unit itself, it's pretty good. But that handle that it com that comes with it is garbage. So if you were thinking about buying this because it has the handle, I wouldn't because like th this entire piece is plastic. There is no metal reinforcement for this for the threads. Uh, this is not going to last long on you. This this is gonna this is gonna break. I guarantee you that this is gonna break. So yeah. So there you go. I just want to test this attachment out and see how it goes. Just pull that tab, twist, or you could have it like that. It's nice. That's nice, but this handle, don't buy it because of this handle. So yeah. So that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.